What is up guys, this is Thomas A. Messon and today I'm going to show you how to transfer your iTunes music to any Android device. Today I'm using the Samsung Galaxy S3. So what you need for this is a computer, iTunes, your Android phone, and a USB um, cable. So all you have to do is hook up the cable to your computer and once you do that there should be a pop-up on your screen. I'm just going to take off these glasses because I can't see for shit. Um, so there should be a pop-up on your screen and uh, on my screen it didn't pop up so what you can do is hit the start then go to computer and you want to go to your portable device and uh, just go on your phone. Mine is the SCH i535 portable device and you just want to hit that I have a card and phone you make sure you hit phone and then you want to scroll down all the way to music so once you see music uh, let's just minimize that for a second and uh, let's go to iTunes I am using Windows 7 um, I don't know why I brought that down I am going to do this video in one take so uh, I'm sorry if I mess up <clears throat> okay so if this were easy which nothing is ever that easy uh, let's just say I want to select all these songs and put them straight to iTunes uh, let's just drag it on to the music and obviously you can um, it's not that easy but there is a very very simple fix for that uh, so on your desktop you want to right click and make a new folder and you can name it whatever the hell you want I'm gonna name it iTunes so once uh, you name that you want to go back and drag your uh, folder so right now I'm having the underwater sunshine album by Counting Crows and uh, I'm just going to drag it into that folder that I just created so once uh, you drag it it's gonna load and transfer all that into the new folder so once you do that you can just uh, exit out of iTunes so if you open up that folder as you can see you have all these songs now you want to hit the first one then hit control A to uh, highlight all of them and select all of them um, if you don't want a certain song you can just individually check mark the ones that you want to go on your phone so let's put that on the side and as you can see all the songs are highlighted and you want to go back to your uh, phone folder alright here we go so hopefully you can see this as you can see it says music and there this should be all of your music already on your phone and then once you highlight one okay so now you want to get all that highlighted music and just drag it into this white space just drag it there okay for this you want to hit the uh, check box and hit yes convert and copy recommended and then as you can see it is copying and there should pop uh, there should be another pop-up soon so right now it's just copying all the songs to your phone so that is how fast it is just that easy uh, it's a simple simple fix and I kinda just figured it out myself it's not that hard um, so I'm waiting for another box to pop up but since I said did that check mark it shouldn't come up so um, if another box comes up just hit that check mark and then hit the uh, uh, recommended or something so once you do that uh, all the songs should be going straight to your phone and um, if you have the Samsung Galaxy S3 I go to uh, I have play music and you just want to go straight to uh, play music if that pops up that means you're doing good like I said this is the Samsung Galaxy S3 and uh, the notification bar what I have checked is this little sync button make sure that's checked um, I'm not sure if if it's not checked um, I it might not work but just to make sure have it checked so the songs are transferring to the phone and it's just that easy 